Hey, what is up? This is Atomic Swift. Welcome back to another one of my videos. Now, this is just a quick video. Maybe other people knew this. I did not know this. So let me uh, bring my tablet back on. So this is a Samsung Galaxy Tab S6. And for people who watch my videos, my computer is actually in my computer room upstairs. And sometimes I'm lazy. I don't feel like coming up here to, you know, download a torrent or something like that. Or I'll have my laptop downstairs and I'll do remote desktop on that and then you can use all the files, you know, you can, you can basically access your computer from anywhere with another computer. But what I did not know, did you know that you can do this with a tablet or your phone? So check this out. This, whoop. This app right here, the remote desktop by Microsoft Corporation, install that. And check this out. Look at that. It is my desktop. You can play video files. I think. Yep. Yeah. It's my drunk friend singing in the bathroom. I mean, check, you can you can do everything. Like you can edit text, you can download torrent files, you can do everything from your main computer. Well, on your main computer from your tablet, so you don't even have to go upstairs, or you know. I mean, it's just great. I think it works over the internet too. Like, so I'm just doing it from a local network. My uh, Wi-Fi in my house. Um, said it's just so cool though like this is all the shit that's on my computer look it's Jen's baby look it's Jen's baby yeah, I mean it's just awesome so you just download the app it's free through the uh, Google Play Store on Android and then you want to go um, onto your Windows 10 PC Windows 10 Pro you can't do remote uh, connection on Windows uh, 10 Home. It's got to be Pro. Um, Pro or in, I think Enterprise or something like that. But I know Pro works because that's what I'm using is Pro. And, uh, yeah, it's just pretty cool. Like, like, look, I can access my Google Chrome. Look at that. That is fucking, oh, that is so awesome. Yeah, because, like, I'll be downstairs. I'm like, man, you know, I want to add something to my Plex server or something like that. I'm like, fuck, but I gotta, I gotta go upstairs. Like, I'm all comfy, playing video games, doing whatever. And, uh, yeah, now I don't have to worry about it because I can just do it through this fucking tablet. This, this app is cool, man. This app is so cool. And like I said, the best part is it's free. I said you just set up remote uh, connections through your um, Windows 10. So you just go to the go to the search bar type remote connection you'll see remote connection settings turn on allow remote connections I don't want to show you any of that stuff because it shows you my uh, computer name and all this shit but yeah so you just go into the app and let me actually let me see here um, is that how you turn it off no what the hell is that oh look at that mouse pointer home what's this okay see so all you would do is so this is the main screen of the app right here so when you first installed it's not gonna have this this shows my computer because I added it so you want to click add and you click add PC and uh, it's gonna show whatever PCs I mean it just showed my computer name I don't think that matters who cares but anyway you're gonna need your account username um, it's already added the um, like if your computer if you're the admin it, you can just sign right in with your account, but if you have other people on your computer that are not admins, you have to add them manually through the remote connection settings to allow them to do to use the remote connection feature. But like I said, if you're an admin, you could just do it. You just sign right in. Fucking Alexa, you bitch. Anyway, yeah, so it's pretty cool. Like I said, it's like having your whole desktop right in your fucking hands. It's so cool. But yeah, so that's um. Like I said, that's remote, uh, the remote desktop app. Is that what it's called? That's what it's called. I don't want to misname it here. It is, oh, remote desktop app, yeah. Like I said, it's free through Microsoft. It's cool as hell. Obviously, 
you, you probably wouldn't want to game through that because there is a slight little bit of latency. But like if you're editing like a text document, if you're adding stuff to your Plex server, you know, if you're just doing just, you know, little stuff on your computer, it works nice. Said because, you know, I'll, I'll add something to my Plex server and I'm like, fuck, man, I got to go upstairs and drag it over to my Plex server. Now I don't have to. I can just do it right through my tablet. Uh, yeah, so, you know, I just wanted to share this with, with uh, everybody in case people didn't know. It's a really cool app. Um, so it's what I'll be using. be using it a lot. Um, so, yeah, like I said, just a quick video. Um, thanks for... Uh, um, Thanks for watching all of my videos. I know, look at that wire mess right there. Anyway, thanks for um, thanks for watching all my videos. Thanks for all likes, comments, subs, and as always, bye for now.